folks, please. Yeah, he went, when he gets to that stage of the game, what was it, three minutes to go? I thought we'd done enough. I think, uh, in fairness, I think Chelsea would have been more than pleased with, with the draw out of that game, uh, given the way it panned out. So, to not get anything is a little bit hard to take, I have to say. Um, you saw the reaction of everybody connected to Chelsea. They were absolutely delighted to get maximum points. Um, maybe a little bit fortunate, in my view, but. Uh, the, the goals themselves are disappointing. Um, we're clearly, uh, the first one, it's Willian has got that ability to uh, produce uh, balls that are right on the money, and uh, he's done it. Just uh, tested Lee, and unfortunately, it's gone in. Uh, but we had a good response. Uh, clear penalty going the other way. Um, thought maybe Keo was, was a little bit unfor a little bit fortunate to to stay on. I think he was last man, so you could argue that it was maybe a red card. Um, I thought we had the, the goal that got chalked off. There was a little push on Aspilicueta, I think it was from from Saido, but uh, he would never go anywhere near the ball that actually uh, went on Bruno's head and dispatched it. So a little bit un unfortunate there, but uh, all in all, like I said, you get 87 minutes, and we just played Man City and Chelsea back to back, and uh, there were a few questions asked about us after Spurs, and rightly so. But uh, I think we've answered all those in, in recent displays against Man City and Chelsea today. So we we'll take some some comfort from that. But ideally, we want to take something out of the game because I think our performance deserved that. Thank you. Um, uh, look at Costa if someone who might be gone. It felt like your players. No, we are, people are trying to say that we, we targeted him. We, we didn't do that. Absolutely, uh, absolutely not. He's more likely he targeted our players to be perfectly honest. Um, no, we we wanted a competitive game. I think that was what it was. Uh, I really enjoyed it. I thought it was a really good Premier League game with no no quarter given or asked. And um, um, listen, I played in that position many many years, and uh, I look at his qualities as a as a striker. He's an outstanding striker, but. Uh, on occasions, he, he's got elements of his play that he doesn't need to have, really. He can still have an, an edge, you can still have an element of your play where you can look after yourself, but you don't have to have all the rest of it. Um, I think it takes away from his his performance and his and his image as a player. I think it's uh, it's not necessary, but um, maybe that's how he, he generates the, his feeling in the game, and that's when he's able to produce his best work, maybe, and, and he needs that element to his play. But uh, I just think it uh, detracts from where a good player is. You mean, what, in this game, what, what do you mean? He went over too easy? Yes, time. yes, clearly, yeah. On numerous occasions. Stayed down when there's nothing wrong with him as well. So, don't need that. I've not seen it. It's, it's, listen, he's on a yellow card and it's maybe a little bit of frustration and he's, he's taking the lad out. But, uh, yeah, second yellow card, quite, quite possibly. And it's unfortunate, but... Uh, I've just said downstairs, if, if you want to be a little bit pedantic about it, I mean, uh, clearly there was a lot of emotion flying around the place when they scored the winner. Uh, a lot of their guys flying into the crowd and whatever, and a lot of them were on yellow cards, so maybe they got a little bit fortunate in, in terms of not getting red cards themselves. So, hey ho, it's, it's one of those we were disappointed. We, we felt we deserved something from the game. We haven't got anything, but we take credit from going up against Man City last time out and Chelsea today, and we've done okay. Two okay. minutes on the Mondays outside, please. No problem. Thank you, man.